guys, this is Carrie from Glitzy Glam, and um, I have a video for you. Uh, one is of my guest bathroom and my son's bathroom and guest bathroom are the same. Um, and it is the, I did it in a under the sea theme or a sailboat theme because of the photography my husband took that I have hung up in there. So it, tell me how you like it, tell me what you think. Uh, I shouldn't have in there what I should have in there. Um, I did put some things in there that I like, but you can let me know what you think because uh, there are, uh, there's a seahorse and a starfish in there that I could go either way. I'm not sure if it fits or doesn't fit. Uh, and then I'm going to show you the before and after decor of my bathroom. It's not a big, huge change, but it is um, a change nevertheless. And I just wanted to show you what I've been working on in those two restrooms. And stay tuned for my next bit video will be a Dollar Tree haul or 99 cent store haul or but stay tuned because I will be doing both. All right, here is my uh, guest and son's bathroom and my master bathroom. So stay tuned. I'm gonna start with this photo. This is our guest bathroom slash my son's uh, bathroom. This is the one he uses. Um, all the time and then if we had company this would be the restroom that a uh, company would use now I've always had these little hooks right here on the wall that's for hanging uh, their towels they do not uh, there's no towels on it right now because like I said it's my son's restroom and um, that's up to him <laughs> he's 18 so uh, but this is the curtain I have on here and then here um, my husband had taken that photo, so I decided that that was a uh, good uh, theme to use for this restroom. I bought these towels here from the Dollar Tree. I thought they were cute. They're white. They're just for decor purposes. Um, now, this is um, Dollar Tree. Uh, this is a Dollar Tree seahorse that was bright lime green and I used some khaki paint to tone it down this garland here is from oriental trading and then this photo take me to the sea that was 99 cent store now we're gonna go down here the charger plate was 99 cent store now I have several of those um, I use for events. Um, some say take me to the sea, I believe, and some uh, are the starfish, make a wish upon a star. Um, everything else on this tray was Dollar Tree, and that candle was a Dollar Tree DIY. I wrapped it with the wire, the wire rope, and a Dollar Tree candle. And then I just uh, added that starfish that fell off of this garland. And then again, this starfish was a Dollar Tree item that was um, really bright blue. And I painted it with the khaki sand color. This was from 99 cent store. And again, now we're back to this little towel that says, soak your troubles. All right, that's all for my son's restroom and guest room. Now let me show you what I've done to mine. This is the before picture of my master bath and what I am going to be working on. Here's where I keep my brushes. I have some milk glass um, for my soap and for my brushes and combs, um, milk glass to hold my toothbrush, and for me to keep
keep some little cute soaps in. It has some pretty little roses. And this is the part that I'm going to make over. This worked perfect for me. The red tray and the red drawers, which I did use um, spray paint for plastic. And as you can tell, it did well. A little bit um, worn, but no flakes, cracks, peeling. This paint really, really worked well. I'm just tired of the red color and going to probably go with white. I've always loved white. And then I have more milk glass there to hold some things here. Um, necklace things just earrings, uh, bracelets, and as you can see it has some pretty roses. I keep my perfumes. Now this little gold stand was inspired by Olivia's Romantic Home. I have some jewelry, my perfume, and, um, and this mannequin here. When I close down my Tea Party Boutique, I put that in here. And I had a different thing here for my jewelry, but uh, this is a piece that my daughter left behind when she left for college. So um, it's been here and now I'm using it. And I got this little piece from Dollar Tree. All right, this is the before and stay tuned for after in just a moment. Okay, since I spent a good amount of time on the before video. I'm going to try to keep this video pretty short. Um, I added these pictures to the wall. They're, um, they're very shabby chic and they look really nice on the, the wall in here because of the color of the green paint. And then this is uh, over a towel rack. Um, I have a very, this is one of the very big walls I have, but a narrow bathroom. Now I put these over the toilet. I'm not going to show you a picture of the toilet, but these work well with the colors in here too. And then I just have a white shower curtain for the shower. Now this piece was given to me um, by a cousin when I got married. And then, like I said, most of this you've seen. That's the milk glass I use for my brushes. This is uh, where I uh, brush my teeth and wash my hands, and it's very pretty. And um, I just keep this upside down so that I keep it dry when not in use. And this is the tray that this is the thing that I transformed the most in here. It was red and um, so were these drawers and I just needed a change. So I have um, painted it white and just kind of redecorated this corner uh, with these items I already had in here before I painted the trays white. All right, that's the after of my restroom, uh, after painting the trays and that drawer. And, um, and then when I come out here, this I have not finished. You'll see this later, but this is going to be my war room, uh, my prayer wall uh, when I'm done.